Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, it's about to be over. No. No, poor bird. I'm sorry, buddy. Go into the water. Go. There you go. Go down, buddy. Let's go. Arx finally bombed TBF Gaming, jumping back into our Arc Eternal playthrough. I'm excited to go in today because we've got ourselves some really good tames in this last episode. We got some great tames, and it's going to be a lot of fun to take them out and do some good things. We've got our Alpha Dodo, super awesome. Velma, what's up? And then we've got our Pteranodons. We've got two Fire Pteranodons and a Poison Pteranodon, which means we have a Knockout Bird, which is amazing. I need to get a saddle for you. Let's make a saddle for Ken real quick. We'll do that, and then boom, boom. We also have a Shinehorn, but I don't want to lose it, so we haven't really been throwing it out and haven't named it or done anything with it. But I really want to see how much damage the Shinehorn can do. Because they usually do okay. They usually do right around 1,000 damage, I think, starting off. So we could take it into the cave and, and eat some things. I think we could do that. I also want to see if these are the Pterandons that can go underwater. I can't remember if they can. Creator, I yes, they are. <laughs> That's awesome. All right, cool. I I mention, I we also have an egg. Yeah, I know she's talking really loud. But we also have an egg from these guys, but it takes eight hours to hatch. We're still working on our settings for the breeding stuff. It's still a little bit off. I'm not really sure why. It's a new new server provider that we're using, so it's been a big, big change. But if you guys don't know, this is our Arc Eternal playthrough with everything kind of set to vanilla standards. It's still level 600 max dino, but in terms of the settings for everything, for gathering and XP and all those things is all to just default times one. No additions to the dino stats, no additions to the player stats, although we do have the player stats, like, no, sorry, player stats, total player levels and total dino levels those are what we usually do for eternal which is plus i don't even know how many lots of levels that you can add but since everything is kind of slow i'll show you got guys kind of an example this guy so 238 goes to 240 so you can see it goes up very slow almost vanilla like basically vanilla right all right let's go ahead and pick you up that also means like all the crafting stuff is slow everything is really slow it's definitely a big change but yeah dino wise we're doing pretty good this season we need to slowly get into some better and better face eaters. What I love about Eternal and just Ark in general is, is going out and getting new dinos. But what I don't like is I do like to spend a little bit of time with the dinos that we really enjoy. So like Red Hot was our guy for a few days. And now our bird's probably going to be our guy for a couple days. We'll play with these guys quite a bit. We'll definitely have to check them out. But let's go ahead and take you through. We're going to go over here to kind of see how much. I just want to test out the Shinehorn on a couple guys. Also, the fact that I can fly through water always makes me happy. <laughs> it's an Eternal thing. All right, let's go up here. Just be careful. I know there's sometimes like some sarcos and crazy stuff. Also, it sounds like there's a storm. Be a little careful. All right. Let's just make sure there's nothing crazy when we first land. There we go. Eat all their faces. And now that we can gather quickly, we do got to be careful what spawns in. We really should use an outline for down here. It's a little dark. Hopefully, you guys can still see okay. All right. Melee, melee, melee. And then we've got another level 2, 73, awesome. We'll pretty much have all the stuff unlocked very, very soon. Alright, we're going to keep you right here just so I can retreat quickly. Shinehorn is ready. Alright, time to test. How much damage does the shine... Oh, I thought something was bad back there. Is there a snake or something close that we could test this on? There's a scorpion. I think a scorpion is doable. Okay. Come on. Also, is your light not on? Why is your night light? Come on, night light. Activate. There we go. See how much brighter it is? Alright, he's got 1.5. And we do. I can't hit him. 853. We don't gather, though. That's what we had to test, too. Could you imagine getting a shine horn? I, I just want you guys to know that when we get into genomes, we are absolutely 100% gonna evolve a shine horn through the genome stuff just to make it powerful and awesome all right Hit this guy real quick thank you all right we're good let's pick up our little buddy all right shine shine you're not gonna die we're gonna keep you safe well you got some stuff too good job see shine horn mvp all right so now that we have flight we can make it up here without too much worry i want to see if there's a green snake down here this is like the one area where I do wish we had the outline on, but we try to keep our outline off on the spyglass. So you guys know you can do the spyglass outline. You go like that, like that, boom. And then you can see all the crazy stuff coming at you. It's not a bad idea, but the reason why we don't is, I, I don't know, I, I kind of like the danger without it. 
just a personal preference, but definitely something you can turn on. But it's nice in this cave. For this cave, it's nice, so I can see where all the snakes are. You never want to not know where snakes are. There you go. Eat all their faces. Come on. Eat their face. Eat their face. Gotcha. There you go. Nothing crazy spawned in. We're good. Everything's safe. Nice. There you go. Let me go turn the outline off real quick. But that just kind of gives you an idea. The outline you can turn off and on. It is a great setting. I'm glad that you can make the choice whether you want it or not. We used to always play with it on. And once we turned it off, it was kind of... I just preferred it. So Alt-S opens up your settings. There's so many cool settings in here. We're going to go like that. Go done. Oh, no. What did I turn off and on? Oh, egg targeting. No, that one. Boom. <laughs> there you go. All right. Now we're good. Uh, oh, that's a green snake. Oh, that would have been nice to know where that is. Nope. I'm glad we didn't bring our trike up here. That would have been the Creator, end of everything. I feel like I should let you know. I have identified a Once large again, we can kind of see everything, but not... Oh, is it nearby. nighttime? No, it's not. Oh, my God. Nope. It's full daytime. All right. Let's take a look around. We're, we've got We've got flight now. I'm still going to go on ground quite a bit. We need to get ourselves a couple ground dinos. I do want to test out... The Alpha Dodo. Is that a... That's just a regular Castroids. Let's go a little bit of health. And make sure our hot potions are on our hot bar. Heal you up. Oh, there's a Behemoth Brachio. That'd be kind of cool. There's a Shiny Day... Oh, it's an Enraged. Never mind. Run. The Enraged Blackie Don's what ruined our day the other day. There's a Wyvern. Let's not go that way. Ah, yes. Getting in the air just makes you realize everywhere is dangerous up here. There's another wyvern. Okay, I guess we're not going that way. All right, let's go back to our nice, safe little cove. There's an eternal Giga, and he's already halfway twerped up. Ooh. Can we knock him out without everything else giving us a tr little bit of trouble? Oh, man. How cool would that be? Pick you up. Grab all that. Oh. That stomping made me super nervous for a second there. Alright, I've got these alpha arrows. I don't know how much torpor they do. It's not like a crazy amount, but it's enough to maybe knock this guy out. Oh, he's mad. See, that enraged guy came from way over there. There's also a griffin. Oh, he's down. Oh my god, okay. The problem is I can't really do anything with it. Prime Kentro. Yeah, that Enrage guy is going to run around and do bad things everywhere. Alright, what does that Eternal Giga want? He needs 84 Prime Meat or 6 Alpha Meat. I don't have the stuff for Alpha Meat yet. We don't have it just yet. Alright, let's get back on a bird. I was just kind of excited that this worked to knock him out, though. Right, I hear the bad noise. Let's creep around. All right, where are we at? Try and get my bearings here. There's my area there. Can I make the jump? All right, we got to test it. What is that over there? Blue Prime Magtherium. Ready, go. Oh, you nailed that jump. Good job. Oh, jeez. Why is he mad at us? No, 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 no. Oh, that was so quick. Oh, I was hoping I could get to that door. Why was he mad? Oh, I had one of the death counter. We actually had an episode or two with no deaths. We're back on the death train. Oh, you know what? We can make a eternal resurrection stone. Let's do this. Hold on. Let's get our bearings. It is so stormy and dark. All right. Where is it? Eternal feeder. Eternal... Eternal? No. Finding this is always hard. Hold on. Was it resurrection? No. Eternal. Like, once you find it, it's... There it is. Eternal corpse recovery. Got it? Hopefully it'll recover the stuff that I've just lost just now. I hope. Let's find out. Let's put this little guy in the corner. 
And recover corpse. Yeah, it did. Very nice. Okay, let's test this guy out now. We've done everything else. <laughs> let's go take, test out our lady here, Velma. This is our Alpha Dodo. Should be kind of awesome. This storm, man. What time is it during the daytime? 1600, but it sound, it just feels so late. There's a Pegasus. That'd be kind of cool. You got a little too much health for me to mess with you. I need something easy to eat. All right, let's go. Let's not do damage yet. Let me see how much we do. Here we go. 6,000. We don't gather, though. 6,000, but no gather. Okay. That's not bad at all. Let's pump a couple melee. So it goes from that to what? How much did that really pump it? Come on. There you go. Come on, Dodo. We now do 6,800. <laughs> it goes up so low. Raptor. Let's eat the raptor. Save the Lystro. There was something bad over there. Oh, it's the Alpha Raptor. Ooh. Give me all of your levels. Let's do it. Wait, what kind of Alpha Raptor is it? Wait a minute. Okay, regular Alpha Raptor. Just making sure. No, I'm actually not trying to fight you, buddy. I was actually trying to help you. What are you? I'm a powerful raptor. No, we're getting lots of kills, but since we can't gather anything, we're just leaving dead. Oh, I just saved you. I'm sorry, I forgot. We have a really short memory. All right. Oh, there we go. Oh, no, not wait. All right, melee. Let's get some health. That's looking great. And some more melee. Alright, heal you up. How fast are you in water? Are you a water dino? Let's find out. It's not bad. It's not like crazy fast, but it's fast enough to be good. Alright, you. We're up to 7,000 damage, by the way. Kind of a big deal. Alright, don't eat the Jaboa. Don't eat the Lystra. We'll be nice. There's a tech, though. We need you. We're actually going to jump off and gather this guy. Come here, buddy. Come here, come here. All right. Uh, what's that noise? Oh we, oh, we might have enough electronics to make a teleporter now. We're going to have to go check in a second. Let's eat these guys. Don't eat the Listro. Save the Dodo. Nope, don't eat you. Just because it takes too long. Eat this guy's face. Got it. We will try to get into crafting the stuff for genomes as soon as possible. We got a little ways to go before we can start making a lot of that stuff. Man, this guy might be on the top of the kill count. Quick. We're already at 15. We got to get to 35. Red Hot's way up there. Good job, Alpha Dodo. Oh, that trike looks so cool. I love these trikes. Not enough to let him live, but he looks awesome. Nice, and we avoided all the hits. Plus, we're getting some more crystals out of all this. No, you stay back, Dodos. I'm going to gather that. You guys watch out. Come on. Okay, thanks. There you go. The hitbox is a little weird. That's about the only drawback on this guy. Can I gather while we're on? Oh, we can. Nice. Let's make sure we gather a little bit of prime, too. What is that? A little egg. All right. Uh, no baryonyx? Nope. And now we need to start looking for a tame. So we tested out the guys from the last episode. Oh, uh, we're in the danger zone. Is everything here mutated? Nope. It was just, like, right there. I don't know if it's up the hill or in the water. We'll just keep going a little bit further. Oh, there's something. What are you? Let me see. Creep over the hill. We've got a poison turtle and something. Oh, we've got 26 levels. All right. Progression is done. We don't have to worry about leveling anymore. Who's glowing? Oh, it's a dodo. Oh, he's just sitting here ready for us. 
And it's another female, but it's a way better level than the one we have. And it's just knocked out hanging out. Also you. And we definitely have enough electronics for a teleporter now. Boom. All right. I'll be right back, Dodo. We're going to get you too. You're going to join the team. All right, cool. Uh, it, we definitely need to find a another tame today or a good face eater. That Giga would be great, but I can't quite make the meat because we don't have dino hearts. Oh, watch out for that Baryonyx. We didn't think this through. And maybe we can get a teleporter so we can get to and from base quickly. That would be excellent. But all right, I'll meet you guys back at base. If anything crazy happens, I'll show you. But otherwise, I'll just meet you there. All right, Dodo is back. Dodo did great. Dodo's up to 30-something kills. 31 kills. Absolutely awesome. Doing good, good things. All right, so I, I think I want to verify first that we can't make... Oh, my God, we can. How much does it make? Is it 10 per craft or is it one? It's one. Ouch. All right, that's fine. That's fine. We still have our berries. Let's get that. And my Trandon should be on my inventory. All right, let's go. I know my inventory is a mess like it is every episode. We're going to run over here, get this Dodo, and then we'll see if there is something that we can grab as a tame for ourselves. That gig would be amazing, but we need like four alpha meat for it. And we only have one. Yeah, almost everything we see is going to take multiple meat. And we just can't make that just yet. So, all right, we'll, we'll see what's up. Uh, this should be our... Are you our leader? No, you're only... You're third place. You're not even up there all right, we're going to head over here, feed this dodo, pick up the dodo, and then we'll scout a little bit for a low-tier face eater. If I can find a raptor, that'd be great, but I haven't seen any modded raptors. I don't actually know where that's at, but we keep getting hit by that. Here you go, dodo's still asleep. He is. All right, come here, buddy. I'm going to give you two alpha berries. You should be ready to eat and everything. Good. There you go. Another dodo. Nice. All right. Let's pick you up. Welcome to the team. Sweet. Oh, let's get out of here. I see the spino. All right. Scouting. We're going to look for raptors or just anything of elemental or eternal level that we can get. That would be a nice little face here that we can run around and eat on just a little bit better than the dodo. Because the dodo is great, but the lack of gathering is a big deal. So, raptors. I'm kind of searching for raptors. Alright, we came back to the OG island where we started. It is full danger mode. We got demon Ovis wrecking things underneath us. I was trying to look around and see if there were some raptors. I'm not seeing any raptors. We've gone across like four or five of the islands. So, we might have to rethink what we want to go after. That eternal giga might be possible. We were kind of looking at it. We can put tons and tons of prime meat on it and then just wait forever for it to tame up. It is doable. What is that bird? It's an enraged pteranodon. Oh, man. 90,000. No, no. They aggro from so far away. Please don't aggro. And the the stuff from genomes have taken over. It is everywhere. It's awesome. All right. Yeah, you start seeing, you'll start seeing some crazy combinations of dinos as we fly around. All right. What do we got? Another fire. Another storm sound. get that we're just doing this so we can continue to collect all of these little drop things and then we probably should start collecting a lot of the nodes as well come over here and collect these I don't know which one is the better to collect it but we definitely need a lot of the ore and then we'll start processing it really soon yep I know it's heavy Hold on, do I, can I put some into wait 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 it's not very much Alright, we're level 101 though, that's pretty awesome. Alright, hopefully the bird can carry this much. Oh, you can, you're incredible. There you go. Alright, we're good. Alright, we're going to go just a little bit further on our raptor search right now and see if we get lucky, but there's just been nothing out here. Maybe a higher level Tyrandon or a mating pair for our poison Tyrandon. Not that I remember whether we had a male or female. I really don't remember. All right, if nothing else, this is like our sixth or seventh tech parasaur. So these guys have been everywhere. So we definitely have enough electronics now to make a teleporter and a handset. So we should be good to go now. Man, that's that's kind of crazy. All right, uh, yeah, no raptors though. No, like, kind of low-level face eaters that we can get into today. We've had really bad luck on it. 
We could go to Carno Island, but that starts getting into some really dicey stuff over there. Or to the, uh, the danger zone over there. I'm not really sure. I'm going to skim a little bit closer. We'll cut down through this, this area here. And then maybe we'll get lucky. If not, I guess we can try that Giga with all the crazy amount of meat. Alright guys, we found something definitely worthwhile. Not a face eater, but we need it. It's the Yankee. Hold on, make sure we're on passive here. Hold on, let's get a thing. And it should be a one-shot knockout, I think. Oh yeah, definitely. And he's just eternal berries. This is kind of a big deal. This guy is a huge deal. Alright, there you go. Take all those. Tame up really fast. Yeah. Oldie level 60. Oh, and I forgot to, I forgot to do the bowler thing again. My bad. My bad. He's a little knocked out. Everything's fine. I hear running lost chomps. Always worries me. Please don't eat me. What's up? Alright. That's for scaring me. Another tech parasaur. I'll take it. There we go. <laughs> Tell you, man, in terms of the tech parasaur, has been the most successful day ever. All the tech has been eaten today. Oh, jug bug. What kind of jug bug are you? Oh, token. Don't care about tokens just yet. Eventually, we'll care about that. Oh, my God. We got stuck in another one of the zones forever there. Oh, well, we need to drink water real quick. Please don't anything eat me. All right, we're good. Everything's fine. We've now made our way, like, all around, all around this entire area. Still searching for stuff. Oh, God, no, not again. No, it's about to be over. Oh, God, now there's things get electrocuted. I know, I know. We're going to knock out. It's going up so fast. Can we get out? Come on. We're going to die. Hold on. Come on, buddy. No, we knocked out. And we're dying. No. And there's bad things. No, please don't eat me. All right, that's fine. All right, we're back to the base. <laughs> there we go. Another death today. Dang it. That's okay. Uh, now we just have to get back there to get our buddy. All right, don't get too close to the thing this time. Okay, come on, buddy. Fly with us. Oh, there's a spino. What level are you? <laughs> we're worried about tames while we're trying to do other things. Hold on. No focus. Save our friend, and then we're about the next thing. There's all kinds of bad things near him. Come on, dude. Right on. Come on, man. Are you, you're not knocked out. No, 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 no. Don't get out. Get out. Come on. Why are you not following, dude? Let's go. There you go. You good, buddy? You didn't get torped up or anything, but you were acting goofy. All right, let's get you out of here. We'll go over here, we'll land, and I'll get you sorted out real quick. Wait, why are we getting affected over here? We flew way out. Come on, come on, come on. I'm going to end up dying again. Plus, i got to go back and get my guy's bag. I picked him up. I should have just switched him out. My bad. Uh, we can heal up. That's easy. All right, now i got to go back and get his bag. Make sure I have my clothes on. Not that that matters. Let's make sure we have our transmitter. There we go. That's what we need. All right, ready? We got to do this quick. We got to land, get the bag, and get out. All right, land. Bag. Get out. Oh, what is that? Uh oh. Is that a poison guy? I don't even see what it was. All right, let's give you a little bit of melee. This guy doesn't do much for melee. He's our poison guy, but he'll be okay. All right, there we go. We're all healed up. That's another bad thing. Spirit Plague Hive. That's why there's two of them in the same area. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, it's about to be over. No. No, poor bird. I'm sorry, buddy. Go into the water. Go. There you go. Go down, buddy. Oh, now we're scared. I'm okay with that, as long as you're going away from all the bad things. We're just walking underwater. It's not weird at all. <laughs> All right, can we hurry and finish this? We ran into another another plague thing. It was crazy. All right. There you go. Can we take off? There we go. Yeah, we ran into... I don't even know what it was that time. Oh, is this like a... 
high spawn zone. It's really laggy here. Oh no, we're gonna check it. There's definitely a lot of fish here. I don't know if that's why it's so laggy. It is very, very laggy. A lot of fish. Is that the reason or is it that? Okay. It's a little crazy over here. Alright, we should run, run a quick test on an Alpha RG. Almost 200,000 Torpor at least with this guy. So we should be able to maybe knock out an owl. And there's a bunch of owls over here. We could definitely get an early game owl. That'd be kind of amazing. That would definitely make up for a little bit of the struggles today. Now I just have to find one. The poison one I can't knock out with the poison guy. Alright, Alpha Rex is going down. Good job, buddy. Everything's parachuting. <laughs> awesome. You guys go do your thing. Uh, car no no. Here we go. Elemental Owl Lightning. Alright. How fast is he? Is he as fast as I am? Probably. Alright. We gotta hit him five times without getting hit. We could do it. I think if he hits us, he one shots us though. Does he? Got him. Is that 400,000? We should be fine stamp-wise. I just have to not get hit by this guy. Yep. I see you. Got him. Should be 600. Oh, he missed. Come on. Get out further. Got him. There we go. Alright. Is he still attacking? He's got not land in the water either. Hold on. Stay with us one more time. Oh, where are you going, buddy? Okay, where are you going to go down at? Don't go down in the water unless you go down right there. Oh, no, not in the water, buddy. No. No. Also, he wants 53 prime meat. Oh, never mind. He did fall in an area that's safe-ish, and his food did drain. Oh, he needs 100. I'm sorry, 111 prime. All right. I need all of the prime meat we've ever gathered. <laughs> if we don't have any. <laughs> so I need all of the none. Ah uh, man, let's do let's do this. Can I knock you three out? Okay, there's two of them. There's three. Okay, you guys all go to sleep. We'll switch to someone else. Alright. I know we're hurting for food. I don't, I don't care about that right now. Let's go. Who do I have on me? I've got the Dodo, the Shinehorn, and that's it. It is an Alpha Dodo, though. Hold on. Okay, just depending on what spawns in, we could maybe get enough Prime off of this guy. I see something over there. Let's be careful. All right. Give me all your Prime. That eternal hatchet, love. Good job. There's a hundred. There you go. I think we got it all from just one guy. We got it all. Wow. Alright, that was kind of incredible. Hopefully nothing crazy spawns. Okay, let's go ahead and get a soul ball. I really need to go empty out my inventory. Alright, thanks buddy. We got that. And come on. No, don't pick him up. What are you doing? Because he's got all the stuff on him. My bad. All right. Let's find the owl. He's right down there. All right. I know we're hurting for water. Everything's fine. Okay. No fish come over. Everything's fine. And it's, he's already drained, so we don't even need a taming potion. All right, so it's 111 prime meat. We got that, and I got one good meat. It'll give him a little bit of a boost. He will lose effectiveness, but he should tame out. All right, man, there we go. Owl. I'm going to wait on the owl. Let's go. All right, if we can get back up to our spot. All right, the owl is almost up, 97%. Last couple bites. We'll get this guy up here. We'll go ahead and ball him up. Yeah, there we go. This will be a big tame, a lightning owl and level 600. Perfect tame. Awesome. All right. We need to pick you up. 
where that Bloodstalker comes and wrecks our face. Okay, ready? Come on. I can't quite get him. Come here, buddy. Okay, or land. There we go. Nailed it. All right, back to base we go. I'll see you guys there in just a second. Oh, we did it. <laughs> we saved a uh, Anki. I'm going to take him up to the top of a cliff, and we're going to tame him up real quick. What's the Anki that we had? We had an Anki on our inventory. Female, this is a male. We can breed him real quick. That's perfect. In fact, let's, we can fly this guy all the way back to base. So I'll just beat you guys at base with an Anki in tow. All right, there we go. Let's go ahead and make sure he is knocked out real quick. Everybody's on passive. No, 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 passive. Did I just whistle everybody in the base? I might have. Oh, man. No, no one moved. Everything's fine. <laughs> I, I whistled attack this target. That was my fault. All right, a little bit of eternal berries. Glad you survived, man. You can join the team. Give us another another Anki, so that way if we lose one, this guy will gather all the things for us. Nice. This is a huge tame. All right, let me get a thing for that. Oh, come on. We'll get you a saddle, and we'll get the owl a saddle, and that'll be it for today. Definitely, definitely not a bad day. Let's go like this. And then all your crazy inventory can go like that. Like that. We'll throw it all on the bench down here. Right now, the eternal bench is still our catch-all. It's got everything on it, but eventually we'll get other things, I promise. All right, I need the owl saddle and the anky saddle. Owl times one and anky times one. Come on. Oh, we're short hide. We got that. Got it. All right, cool. Saddle one and saddle two. Sweet. All right, cool. So the Anki is nice because it gathers everything, and it's also a crafter of things. It can grab a whole bunch of things. We'll show you that real quick. Do a quick screenshot and then call it a day. There's where's our Anki? Way down here. So there's Eternal Anki. There's the better of the two. Go saddle. And then we've got the Owl. Lightning Owl. This one was a huge tame. And they look so cool. I, I really like them. And they get really cool mutations when you start breeding them out. The color mutations on these guys are incredible. There you go, man. Two huge tames. Double screenshot. Just the owl. Because he looks amazing. And then uh, let me show you really quick. I don't. You guys don't have any special things on your inventory, right? No, just regular owl. Should have good damage. I guess we could test that real quick before we end it. And then we'll probably level him a bunch in the next episode. There you go. There it is. We do 4,000. And we do electric, so he'll knock things out too, which is awesome. I have identified a and he's so fast. Do you fly under the water? Nearby. We'll test that later. We'll test that later. He's fast on the ground too. And then our Anki, hit hold E to ride, gathers all the things. And we can left click so we can just keep going fast. Don't have to slow down at all. And you see just from everything. We gather metal, we gather stone. Stone doesn't really get much, but from trees and plants. He'll get all the things. Maybe, eventually. He's making me a liar. Come on, man. There we go. Rare flower, save root. We get the crops. We get green gems. A little bit of everything. But all right, guys. We're going to end there. Hope you enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe. We can also kill and gather things. We didn't get hide, though. But all right. I'll see you in the next episode. Thank you so much. A huge shout out to the patrons. A huge shout out to you for checking this video out. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.